Google says you're asking how to set this Epson C4000 up with Wi-Fi. Well, this is how you do it. This is called a dongle. It's an additional accessory to allow the printer to work via Wi-Fi. Plug in the USB dongle into the USB port on the right hand side. Make sure your printer is turned off while you do this. So now we turn the printer on. So now the printer's turned on, we can go into the menu options, scroll down to general settings, and in there you'll see network settings. Then click into Wi-Fi setup. Once into the Wi-Fi settings, you'll have two options for connections, either router or Wi-Fi direct. First of all, we'll show you how to do the router connection. This is for if you've got an office or a static Wi-Fi router. We'll click start setup, and go to Wi-Fi setup wizard. This is where I look for all the local networks to connect to. Then we'll click into ERS Wi-Fi, which is our Wi-Fi network internally. I have the option of entering the password. Once the Wi-Fi password has been entered, we can hit Start Setup. So it's now connected. So when it's connected, you should see this, this icon on the screen here. And now it's set up and working. Let's see if it works wirelessly on my wireless laptop. There we go. When setting up your Epson C4000 into wireless mode, we would recommend using the router option rather than Wi-Fi Direct, just for simplicity. If you get stuck, you know where we are, just call ERS.